that, yes. But my awesome thing of the week is, uh, well, well, first off, uh, Sorg or Wheels, Aaron, on, on the uh, chat here, you can attest that sometimes you're out at an event and the most frustrating thing in the world is when the phone dies. In today's culture, without your cell phone, you are done. You're dead. And I, for one, do not have the patience to wait hours and hours for a phone to charge. I don't, I, and I'm at the point now where I don't even want to charge my phone overnight. That's how lazy I am. So I found ways around it. And the way around it is the nice little turbo charger or rapid charger. I actually have two versions. I have the Verizon version, which is awesome because it is a long cord and it actually has a little flashlight where you can actually see the port so, so like, like for audio the flashlight is on the end like the usb port like the mini yes. the micro usb port at the end there it's a little flashlight a little button here you click it so you're hung over drunk in the middle of the night you need to charge your phone because you got to wake up for work the next morning click the little button and you can find out where the import is on your actual phone and the right way too because that's yeah, the one the right that you way. always get backwards exactly <laughs> this one's kind of cool because it glows mm -hmm. in the dark mm -hmm. so you can kind of see the charger I like it, but the one I like the most is the one that came with my phone. It's um, I have a, Mer a Moto Turbo, and this one's awesome because this one charges a little bit faster, actually. And the nice thing about it is you can actually hear the, the sweet hum of electricity soaring through the turbocharger. It's really great. It's a soothing noise to fall, to, to fall asleep to because you know when you wake up, you're going to have a super charge. It's, a, it's great. It's a freaky. It's fast. It's also phone friendly. It's a phone friendly charger. <laughs> and uh, what's cool about it is there, there's two different types. The type I have is called a Quick Charge 2.0. And uh, only certain phones have this. The Moto Turbo does have it. That's why I got the phone. I uh, used to have a Samsung, and that's all I did was charge it. It, it was the, the worst thing in the world. I charged it overnight. I charged it during the day. I had to charge it in the car. I had to charge it in my vehicle at work. I was a delivery driver. All I was doing was charging the phone, and the moment I take the phone off the charger, it's done. Not with the turbo charger. Uh, I love the turbo charger. They claim, according to Lifehacker, they claim that it will charge 60% of your battery life within a half an hour, and it takes hours longer to get the rest of the 40%. My experience, that that's not the case. I can charge my entire phone a full charge in under 40 minutes. It's really fantastic. It's uh, it's made it's it's changed my life for real. It has changed my life. It has freed me. I am free now, thanks to the turbocharger. And, and I'm telling you, the electricity pouring through that thing—you can literally hear the thing buzzing. I'm, I'm sitting in the I, bathroom because I, I got my phone on the charger. Because again, I can charge my phone almost a full charge while just taking a shower, in, in a 15-minute shower. It's unbelievable. But I hear this buzzing noise, and I'm. I'm like, what in the world is this buzzing noise? And I realized it's just the amount of energy soaring through this little black box on this charger. It's uh, definitely a worthwhile investment. <laughs> so Alex in Alex in California uh, on the chat room says, and I'm kind of I'm kind of wondering myself. He says he says uh, I don't think the humming is a good thing. Sounds like a good short circuit. Oh, it's, the, it's the sound of power. <laughs> like I feel like it's, it's not a safe sound. It's a soothing sound. You know that hum means a full charge is coming, and boy, does that just that just allows me to rest easy every night knowing that I can wake up to a full charge phone or I don't even need to charge my phone at night. I can wake up, jump in the shower and throw the phone on the charger and, and I know it's set. Mm. I know people say it's risky. They sound like they say it may sound like a fire hazard. I say it sounds like life force coming to my phone. <laughs> and uh, you're, you, all of your I, friends I, will love you because of it too because they want to borrow a phone charger. You say, here, spend 15 minutes. Your phone will come back to life and... They say, no, no, that's impossible. It takes hours. It takes hours to charge a phone. I said, I kid you not. Take this phone, 15 minutes, bring it back. You'll be at least, at least 30% charged. And every time I'm right. I will say this technology, it has come a long, long way. Um, and it's something that um, Motorola picked up, Samsung picked up a lot of the, a lot of the different phone manufacturers picked up. And it has also changed the way I think about charging. I used to be more into i'm going to bring two power bricks with me so if i need to i can i can recharge my phone without hugging the wall per se um i know i know samsung's made a made an art of of talking about wall huggers and 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 whatnot mm -hmm. um 
Apple's kind of fired back with their own their own case, the the battery case. We we see a lot of uh, products from uh, Mophie with their their juice packs and whatnot. Um, but I will say the the this quick charge technology. He, he's, he's spot on it. The, the, the way that I use devices nowadays, um, it, it's, it's night and day, um, getting that, that charge in, in, in minutes. I almost equate it to how Apple talks about their pencil, which I think is using the same technology. Uh, I think, it was something like a one minute charge gets an hour of battery life or something wow. like that. Um, I've also noticed that with the, the, some of the touch pads and keyboards that I even have around the house. Um, so I, I hope this, this, we continue down this path. Uh, I'm hoping next on the stop is not only a, a fast charge, but increasing that battery life. And that's what I'd like to see kind of next. Yeah, I agree. And, and to me, as far as cell phones go, that that's the number one priority is to, is to be mobile. It's a mobile phone. Uh, my my last phone, it, honestly, it was like a, a corded phone. You just couldn't walk away from the wall. Mm-hmm. It, it was terrible. Mm-hmm. Awesome, awesome. Well, good. Check- so, if they want to check it out, this is specifically the the Motorola model, right? I have both. I have a Motorola and I have a standard Verizon model. Okay. I would suggest not buying it from Verizon, though, because I spent like 30 bucks on this, and you can probably find it online mm. at half the price. Yeah, so. I, and I'm finding a lot of... Unfortunately, I think I think very, turbo chargers kind of genericize, because I'm going to get a lot of random quick chargers, but I am getting like the Motorola Turbo Power well, There's 15. two different types. That's the thing. The mm. Motorola one, it's... Uh, Let's see, I have it written down here. It actually will uh, bring. It'll put out nine volts mm-hmm. uh, on the uh, the turbo charge. That's the uh, the quick charge 2.0. But that won't work with every phone. I, I don't believe. I believe it has to be specific phones that are set up. Uh, Nexus has a phone. Uh, there's a Note that that'll work with quick charge. HTC One. Uh, like I said, the Moto Turbo, the Moto X. Both of those work with a. Uh, with the uh, quick charge, so I would ask if if you're in if you're interested in in buying that particular one, I would definitely do your research or, or mm-hmm. ask and make sure that your phone is quick charge 2.0 capable because there are two di- there's different types of rapid charge. So chargers. this this is a whole other different standard for 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 charging then. Yeah, yeah, the quick charge 2.0 it's it's supposed to be even faster than a regular rapid charger, but I I can't say even the the generic Verizon rapid charger it's still night and day the difference. Awesome, awesome. Good yeah, Samsung recently put out too. They they put out a wireless quick charger. Really? So they they have the they have the charge pad that does the the G, um, it's QI wireless power, um, but it does the the fast charge speed, which is which is pretty cool. It, it's, it it'll set you back seventy bucks for the Samsung branded fast wireless charger, mm-hmm. but it's kind of neat because you can just. Literally put your phone here. I have one sitting beside me. Um, you can literally put your phone down on this hockey puck looking thing. Obviously, hmm. there's a typically a cable that plugs into it. Um, there it is right there. Uh, micro USB. And then this plugs into the power pack that you were talking about. And I can literally come home, put my phone like this, and it just starts quick charging. So, so but, but you, it does run a, at a much higher price point. And you need both pieces, the wireless charger and that quick charging uh, power brick. Mm-hmm. And, and I also have like uh, the, the Asus, the Windows uh, machine that I have, um, it has that USB 3.0 and it says it's a quick charge and it, and it activates if it's plugged in and everything, right? Um, so, I mean, and that's probably not as specialized as what you guys, probably not as quick say. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's probably just pushing more ampage to it or something. Well, that, that's pretty right? much what they all do is that yeah. it opens up the floodgates for the, uh, the amperage. But, mm-hmm. um, yeah, I... I love it. I, I, like I said, it's really it's changed my life. I can, uh, and especially at work because I could just I could charge my phone at work, just throw it on the machine. And now that I have the Bluetooth headset, uh, similar to, uh, to what we were talking about before, I'm able to throw it on the charger at work and just walk up and down wherever I'm working, and uh, and, it, and it charges within within minutes. But uh, and I really like the idea uh, that Chilla was talking about with that pad, uh, because especially you get those phones uh, eventually. If you're like me, I throw my phone on my bed while I sleep, and then uh, it gets all gunked up where you plug the import in. So that kind of solves that problem, which which mm-hmm. is nice because that was another problem with my my last phone. Is I, I, it looked like it now? This is before I had the charger, the uh, turbo charger. So it's not because of the humming, sending too much power, but uh, the input for the uh, micro uh, the micro input it 
looked like it was on fire or something like that. I, I don't know. I bought the phone used, so I, I think it came that way. But it, it was it, that would have been a nice thing to have a pad where I could have just put it down and let it charge and not have to worry about about that. So.